Hey, welcome back to Let's Play Future Cop. This time we're taking on Venice Beach, the fourth stage. As you can see, there's only eight stages, so we're about halfway through. Let's start. We've been set up. My bet is Big Vic put a hit on you. Yeah, if you remember the last time, previous video, some crime lord wanted our help to take out another crime lord or something. Or some piece of me. Whatever. And now they're all firing on us, which will give us a good time to test out our new weapons. We still have the old gun. Because it's still best for now. But we got the new secondary weapon. Rockets. Boom. High velocity rockets. They fire four for a time. Maximum. You can fire you can control how much you fire at one time by tapping lightly. It's not really control because it's so hard to control it. But it'll fire it as a set. So that means if you fire two it previously like I did, you only can fire two next round. This deal smelled fishy from the get-go. Yep, whatever. Anyway, we have to activate these nodes. And then I'll show you the other weapon. See those annoying dudes? Plasma! Boom. They're dead. Except him. He's escaping not on my watch. Yes. That sound clip is annoying. Anyway. That's three. The canal door oh. should open now. Without further ado, let's get those gates open. All warrants are in place. Destroy the bayonet boy. Hey man, that's illegal entry. The way you do it. Break this bad boy's grip on the south canal zone. Legal entry. We're the police. We can do whatever the hell we want. Oh yeah, if you're wondering what would happen if you walk into the wall, in walker form, into the water over there, death. Just plain death. <laughs> ah! Ah, oh, shit. Yes, the stupid corpses per se. Sensor show another switch in your vicinity. Find it. Oh. Vehicles is annoying. Here Collision in this game is very iffy. Now door is open. You're our right, if I'm you unlucky, you'll get to see me sink to the ground and die in the walking form. But there's platforming in this game. It's really annoying that they included it, but yes, it is in this game. And is it in this level? And about the high velocity rockets, they waste extremely fast because you fire forward the power field is off. So I'm probably not gonna use it next level. Shield. Bow. He only went to the water there. We don't recognize your authority here, man. He's acting so cool. That's a heavy weapon power up. And now, we get the heavy weapon power up, which wastes even more by firing 8 rockets. Boom. Again, it's effective and all, but... <coughs> Sorry. But, yeah, wastes fast. High velocity rockets does. Anyway, we activate those two switches over there. Come here. Gun goes down. Activate this switch here. Power field is off. Let's go. Let's Why are you doing this? What are you doing? That guy's whining non-stop. Live free or die, you mother! Shut your mouth! Ooh, you used the bad word. Just destroy the escape with a plasma. Mayday, mayday. Luxury yacht, throat warbler mangrove under attack. Save us, please. Uh, how dare you interfere with my salvage rights? <laughs> yeah, we're supposed to save that ship and all, but it's making noisy. 
noises and so I just kill it. And as I mentioned before, it doesn't really matter. You got a crowd control situation on the beach. Don't shoot civilians. Protect and serve. No, I have been killing and killing all this time. Why should I? And they're making those annoying annoying loopings. That jetty, it's the only access into Vic's territory. Annoying looping irritating sound effects. Why should I protect them and serve them? Anyway, let's jump over here. Platforming, yo! Take your time. You don't want to die and start the level over again. And here is That's a heavy weapon power up. Yeah, that. There's so many voice clips in this game. You underestimated the value of carbo loading. It's hard to speak over it. Anyway, you can use this plasma to destroy those mines. Don't worry about it. Excuse me. <coughs> oh, that was terrible. <laughs> I might cut that out. Anyway, here's the switch to the door. Which makes renders the door completely useless. Where did you find a nerve to confront me in a bottle? You've got to cross the electro bridge. Sensors show a switch in your area. Alright. Let's use the walker form to climb up here. That switch lowered the drawbridge. Yep. We lowered the drawbridge, but we need to activate another switch, which is here. Deactivated an electro bridge. Now you're getting the hang of it. Yeah, I don't want to waste my ammo on those loady, loady people. I just walk over them like they're nothing. Look at them. I walk over them and they frag up. I'm just that awesome. Yeah, this is the annoying thing about this game. Targeting really sucks. They even target stuff behind terrain and such. That's another drawbridge down. Looking good. Yep, activate those switches. That lowers the drawbridge. Activate this one. We'll deactivate that. The casino barrier is down. Time oh, to pay a visit that. to Big Vic. Out of my way, peasant. Where are they looking? Why are they looking? Seriously, that's some uh, low quality guards. Oh well, let's go up Big Vic's place. My lactic acid munitions will cool your jets. Lactic acid. I don't know chemistry, don't ask me. Right, let's just wipe the floor by it of everything here. Oi! See? See? When I try to target that thing, it targets something behind under there. Which is clearly farther than that thing in front of me. <laughs> Thank you! That is so helpful. Anyway, we just have to go over here. Uh, he's getting charged up, let's say. Yep, that's right, charge it up. Wasn't very Can't stop over him. Remotely detonate those things by pressing the fire button again. Ew. Whatever. Right. Oh shit. I'm not gonna die in this one. Come on. Yeah. This boss, you basically just have to hit him when he surfaces. 
get him again. Oh dear, I pressed the button twice. That's a pretty lame mechanic actually, but I think the remote detonation thing has its uses. Oh shoot! See, I'm killing myself with that. I have to kill him. Please die. Please die. Oh, sorry. You didn't see the death animation, but don't worry, it's just him fragging to pieces. Hooray. Not really. Okay, we're done! Next is Hell's Gate Prison. Let's watch the briefing. But before that, we have Gatling Laser! Woo! But no other weapons. I'm just gonna go back to the concussion beam and stick with the plasma fire since the best. X1 Alpha, we have a code 7X situation at the Hell's Gate Maximum Security Facility. The prison is under siege by a terrorist group called Apocalypse. They're attempting to free their leader, a psycho named Vehar Telkai, recently transferred from Folsom. Apocalypse has managed to gain complete control of the prison. They don't take prisoners. All security defenses and guard personnel are under attack. The last communication came from the infirmary. Start there. Prevent Vehar's escape at all costs. Apocalypse is extremely well equipped. Focus on their dropships. Without them, there's no way out of Hell's Gate. Okay. Well, we'll tackle that next time. Thank you for watching. Later. Bye.